Yeah, all right, so you got a while. It did it last Friday. <laughs> did it? It tripped out last Friday? It tripped out and pressed the button. It's been working since. Okay. But I figured it's going to go, there's something wrong. Something's going on with it. We'll yes. see if we can figure out what it is. <sighs> Off on safety. I had to put that fire alarm up, too. Oh, okay. How's the chickens doing? My chickens are doing well. That's good. Let's see if we can figure out what's going on here. Yeah, Joe's is not doing that well. He's not? Yeah. Oh, you're not getting any younger, is he? No, it'll be 89 in September. He's got hardening of the arteries in the legs, and then God knows in the brain, I don't know. It's good. Got something going on in the brain. I think he's got Alzheimer's. Alzheimer's, yeah. yeah. So, um, you did try to hit the reset button, you said, right? I did, and it, and it started, but then it went on. Okay. And you put a new filter in it when you were here, last. I think I did a nozzle last time I was yeah, here. Yeah, the, the nozzle, yeah. I want to see if it's getting any oil or what's going on with it. Mm, it looks like it's got a little bit of oil spill there. Oil <sighs> yeah. 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 All right, we'll see if it squirts oil out. Should squirt on the start. Should squirt oil out there. That's my truck. Oh. I got it warming up. It's flipping cold out there. Yeah. <laughs> Should stop. It's 18. Yeah, it's cold out, man. Well, it was colder the other day. It was 12. Trying to warm up my truck, you know. I uh, I've been leaving it outside because I got this little um, this little golf cart inside my garage. It's called a da Taylor Dunn. It's like the like the stuff they use at airports and stuff. It's what a little. Want a golf cart? It's a it's a little electric. It's kind of a, like a little electric car. I'm gonna use it for around the yard and stuff. Huh? I just haven't had time to. You can't walk. Yeah, I can walk, but. Play golf. No, no, it's it's kind of like a little cot where you could, you know, um, could be that control's bad. This flipping control might be a might be a problem. I've had problems with them. We'll, we'll put it. We'll see if it fires. It's kind of like a golf cart. It's not really a golf cart. It's kind of. It's an electric, you know. It's yeah. an electric vehicle, but it's it's got like a tr it's got like it's like a little pickup truck. Really? Yeah. It's tiny though. You know. It's like. Yeah. It's got bad. It's battery powered, but it's it's a cool. It's really cool. You don't see many of them around. How big is your yard? <sighs> My oh, yard's yeah, pretty big. Yeah. <sighs> yeah, one of my rooster was um, tearing up all the chickens. 
Like all the, the backs of the chickens tearing all the feathers off of the backs. Oh, yeah, yeah. I had to get rid of him. I mean, he was really raising havoc with them. Yeah, As he got older, he started to get violent with them. Oh, jeez. You know? Yeah. Oh, yeah, we were, we used to have chickens years ago. At first, when he was young, he was fine, you know, he was gentle with her, but now he got to the point where he was really, yeah, I mean, re really, really bad, so I had, to get, I, had, I, had to, I had to get rid of him. Bad news. Domestic violence, I call it. Yeah, yeah. You know? Yeah, sometimes they do that. All right, let's sometimes, try, let's see what happens. Sometimes they pick on one chicken, too, you know? Oh, you had chickens? Oh, yeah, we had chickens, yeah. We had ducks, we had chickens, we had a pig. <laughs> you had pigs? One, one pig. Yeah, did you ever have goats? Oh, goats. I was raised on goats, you know. So what did you like best? The chickens? I, I didn't like the chickens too much. The goats were nice. You liked the goats? Yeah. You liked the goat milk? Yeah, well, get used to it. it was yeah, it's, it's actually healthy for you, huh? Yeah. Out, yeah, it comes homogenized. Now, what about, uh, did you have a cows? No, never had cows. But the, what about the pigs? So you raise the pigs yes, for food? Yes, one pig. One for, pig. For, for, for food? Yeah. 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 Well, we had it's four or five goats, though. Huh? We had four or five goats. Yeah, yeah the females? Yeah, we have one billy goat too. They're pretty mean, huh? The the the, the billy goats. Yeah, they they can be aggressive. Yeah. 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 I remember one of them pinned my brother in the stall. Did he? Yeah, this, this billy goat had these horns. God. Yeah, they could they could be pretty mean. Yeah. So did your did your uh, brother fight him off? Yeah. Yeah. But uh, yeah. Okay, <laughs> there goes the police and shit right now. We had a wagon too. If this thing fires up, I'm going to change this control in the CAD cell. I think that's what our problem is. We're going to see if it fires. Yeah, so it's burning. Fired right up in there. See? Could be the CAD cell's bad. See how it shut off? Yeah. It's probably that CAD cell. The CAD cell might be bad. I'll have to change that and see. But it could be this control also. Let me get what I need out of the truck. We'll try just the CAD cell first. my little camera. We'll try changing this cat cell for us. So what's happening is she's firing up yeah. and then she's shutting off. So yeah. that's the safety. It's shutting off on safety. This might be bad. So we'll put a new one on there and try it. And if this, and if it continues to shut off, we'll have to change that control out. What that does is that sen once it fires, that senses the light yeah. and keeps this thing from tripping out. It's a safety. Well. You know, in other words, if that wasn't working in there and the thing didn't fire, it could fill up with oil. So it's a safety. We'll try it again. Up nice. Nope. See, she shut off. So we'll have to, it's got to be that controls bad. Change up the control. Well, it's not easy to get old, right? No. It's supposed to be the golden years. I don't know. The golden years. Yeah. Change up the control. We'll try putting a new control on there. So she's firing up, but she's just not staying on. So. Try changing it out. The golden years. Yeah. This one just don't have the um the late oil valve tap, but that's okay.
golden years. Yeah. That's okay. Trump's going to make everything okay. What is it? Trump's going to make everything okay. Hmm. Make America great again. Oh, Trump? Yeah. You don't feel it, Trump? <laughs> Let's see this. I didn't like either one of them, so. No. There's a lot of wires in there. Yeah, this is, we're just going to have to tie this, uh, we're going to have to tie this, in, this, uh, this OSB valve into something else, so. Yeah, a lot of wires, huh? Yeah, it looks like spaghetti. the whites. Well, at least Trump is trying. He's trying. Yeah. No? Yeah, he is, yeah. But the trouble with Trump is he doesn't want to take anybody's advice. He thinks he knows everything. Yeah, well, that's probably not the case, huh? That's not the best thing. Okay. We'll see. He's the president, after all. Yeah, he's the... The president, so. Yeah. But I would like to know how much it's costing the taxpayers for security because they have to secure Trump Towers in New York. His wife is there, his son is there. They have to secure the White House, they have to secure Camp David. And then he keeps going to Florida, so that means they have to secure that. Well, they have to, they did the same thing for the other moron that we had in there. I know, but at least he used Camp David. He didn't have another place that he went. And then this one's got a large family, so every time his kids go off, he had two sons go to South America. That meant security down there in South America. I like to know how much it's costing us for security. Yeah, I'm not sure. That's a big box. It's a big, it's a, uh, either way, it's big bucks for everything, no matter what they do, you know? Well, today. <laughs> Secret Service and all that shit, so. Yeah. Just tying the um, tying the motor and the, uh, the late oil valve together, so. something with the white.
where do you get your grain from? Uh, I've been getting it from the Ventura grain. Uh, you ever hear of them, Ventura grain? No. In Taunton? Oh, they're, yeah, the lady up there. They're, they're, they're the cheapest, Ventura grain. They, they make their own grain up there. It's it's cheapest. Yeah, the lady up the street used to have chickens. She, she said she used to go to Taunton. Yeah, that's the one, Ventura, yeah. It's probably like, you know, $11 for a bag. Around here, you get them for 15 so... Yeah. If I'm buying, you know, six, eight bags at a time, it's worth going, you know? And that's, that's what I'm doing. I'm buying a lot, so. So the lady said she used to go to Tyne. That she must yeah, have, she, she must have been to go going there to Ventura. I never knew the name of the place, but she used to go to Tyne. Yeah, Ventura going. Uh... Yeah, because I had bought some, some feeders and waterers off a guy that had, you know, a bunch of chickens. And he told me about that Ventura grain. Yeah. So, usually guys that have been doing it for a while, they know they know where to go. Yeah, right. Uh, yeah. You know, they they know that they know where um, the best deal is and all that stuff. Now, what do you do with the chicken manure? Oh, I, um... I put it in. I, I put it in the back of the house, and I I rototill it. I kind of I'm gonna make a I'm gonna make a compost out of it that, for, the, for the garden. You know, very effective, very strong. Very yeah, strong very strong. Yeah. yeah, but I want to make compost. I want to do a garden this year. Yeah. So I want to do. Uh, that's what that's what my plan is to do a garden this year. So. You don't have animals up there like deer and woodchucks. And I do have woodchucks. Yeah. Pains. Yeah, they'll probably um, yeah. ruin everything for me, no? Well, I had a little garden. I fenced it in. So it went under the fence. Well, yeah, that's what I'm playing. I'm going to have to do something about taking them out, you know? Yeah. Well, they, went, they went under the fence? Yeah. Now what did what did you end up doing? Did you end up? Uh, I gave up. <laughs> you gave up. They couldn't you couldn't stop them. No, they keep digging. They keep digging. Yeah. Yeah, they keep digging. Yeah. Yeah, I had a great big one. I saw them waddling across the yard. There. Yeah, well, I, you know, I might not give up as easy as you did, so we'll see. We'll see. We'll see who wins the battle. But then I get deer, too, because they come through the back. Oh, the deer, yeah. Yeah, there's a pond back there, and they come to water, and then they come come on the land. In fact, that's why across the street and down the road, they got those fences around the, uh, the edging, you know? Yeah. Because the deer eat those ewes. The white, no, I got one ewe in the All right, we'll try it again. We'll see what happens. Denada. Huh? Denada. Right, if you stayed on it with a bad control. But I'm going to leave that new cat cell in there too with, with the new control. But that's what it was. It was a bad control. Hey, you know, any, anything can break, you know, uh, you know things don't last forever. What is it? It's nine years old. Nine years old. Well, it definitely was the problem because it was, it was, shut, it was tripping off on safety and it was, it was running in there. You know, it had the light, so I put a new CAD cell and I new, put a new protector relay. You when know, I, when I went to the hospital in December, it should be all right. So this is this is a 2008. This is a rare flu, rare flu low boy. That's it, we got a protected oil line here. Filter's still good. 
Now who did this job? Uh, I was John Sylvia at the time. John Sylvia did it? Well, he's the one that coordinated the Propane. Alright, well, that's it. I'll just get you a slip and I'll be on my way. I like John Sylvia. Yeah, he was a good guy. He was a good mechanic. Yeah, very good.